Next up, we got Rick Ross. Let's get it. So look, bro. Rick Ross responded. Top five dead or alive, man. If y'all rock with me, I keep telling y'all that. Rick, like, really top five dead or alive in my, uh, my one, two, three, four, five rap place. You know what I'm saying? Um, bro responded. He heard Drake say something about the female he was messing with and him being 50 years old, even though bro ain't 50 years old then. Yeah. Bro hopped in the studio the same day. And release the record. And I'm like, yeah, that's why he's my top five. I'm not finna hold y'all no longer. Y'all know how we get down with the likes and the comments. Do that for me. Other than that, we about to get cracking. Let's go. Fish tanks and marble floors living big and bad. Niggas laugh until they hit with my official jab. Crack smoke is the exhaust from my pen and pad. Ghost writers, they get the floss. Rick Ross is my guy. He is. Stanks and marble floors living big and bad. Niggas laugh until they hit with my official jab. But by you saying niggas laugh until they get hit with your official jab, bro, I seen them boxing videos. Your boxing is trash. We laugh at your official jab. You know what I'm saying? You still my boy. Don't give me. Hey, look. Hey, promise you. Top five. Actually, the number two slot. Behind, I don't want to say nothing because I don't think y'all cool, but yeah, behind him, promise you. But that that jab, that jab bar was, that was a bar, bro. Yeah. Crack smoke is the exhaust from my pen and pad. Ghost writers, they get the floss, what you could have had. Record label taking a loss, are you in your bag? You a worker on the chart, don't make me laugh. Get the mind, tell by my watch, this a different time. Living fine, I'm getting high, it's your shit decline. Who believes he moving keys in his loop? One thing about somebody that's self-made and a real boss, bro, um, they will always feel superior. I don't care, bro, if you working for somebody and you making more money than him. They will always feel more superior than you because they are bossing you, the worker. Always. And I said this on the last uh, record I did with the Drake this. Everything Ross saying, this just didn't like, I'm going to say this because he dissed me. Nah, bro, been feeling like this. But we making money together, so why I'm going to say something? They, they, this duel is crazy when it comes to the records. <laughs> crazy. Louis V's run up on you and snatch your chain. Watch you bitches bleed. Feel the pain or just describe where you really ride. Either you niggas getting money or ready to die. B.I.G. or give a fuck if you T.I. Lee. You got it and you keep it tucked if you be by me. Do the job, better known as the Charles Schwab. Double loss, spread through the yard and I swear to God. Pop a perk for the feel, go and count me a meal. Kill you niggas for free, do it all for the thrill. Niggas leaking they records when we speaking directly. If we keeping it gangster, when you see me, you check me. Speaking of leaking records. Another thing, when I was looking for both of these records with the Drake and the, uh, this Rick Ross disc, they leaked it and I feel that they feel it's that important for the simple fact that it ain't on none of their uh, official channels, like their music channels, their YouTube page, right? I say that to say this. I recommend both of them for not wanting to get paid off these disc records. I do. It don't look like they're making no money and to keep it real, the re-uploaders, the music reaction channels, they the ones that's gonna eat off the record more than it look like these fools is. So hats off to them for that one, man. White boy, I see you. I see you. Yeah. Check. Getting bullied, don't walk up on me cause the clip is fully Niggas pussy don't wanna push me, I'm like really Woody Like his moves, but he never had a fight in school Always ran, another nigga had to write your grooves Flow was copying your pace, Wheezy gave you the juice Another white boy at the park, wanna hang with the crew Pull it surprise when I'm switching up like Dyed Denim Get incentives for all the killings while we ride rentals Look me right in my Ross know what he doing by calling him white boy so Drake, I remember he had the little black face, right? And a lot of people like, well, he is black. He makes with the woo woo. So when they talk about light skinned niggas, right? 
that category don't fit. Some people would do, but the most people, most black people, that category don't fit nobody that's mixed. When they talk about a light skin nigga, they talk about two actual black people that had a light skin baby. You know what I'm saying? Like my mom, my dad, dark as hell, right? And I came out light. And not saying they gotta be dark, they can be brown skin, they can be light skin. It's just that if both of your parents is black, then you're a light skin nigga. If both of them not, bro. I don't care if you got a white and a black, Asian and black, masculine and black. That's just mixed. I'm keeping it real with you, bro. You 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 half and half. Drake Rick Ross is playing this. That gets on a dry skin. Trust me, I know a lot of mixed people. And if you are mixed and you got some black in you, right? And you carry yourself as a black man and they know that your dad is white, them clowning you over that will get under your skin, bro. That is nothing you will be able to shake ever it's something that you got to accept. And I promise you, them them remarks, them calling Drake white, that gets under his skin, bro. For sure. For sure. My face, he beginning to shake. Told you niggas stay scheming. I predicted my fate. Got more money than you. Fuck you want me to say. 50 mils for the crib. Where you want me to stay? I can shoot up the block. I got bitches to pay. Let you DM my old, but got bitches you can't. Let you get on my songs. It was good for your face. Now bitch nigga is home. And no room for debate. Mm. Pop a perk for the field. Go and count me a meal. Kill you niggas for free. Do it all for the thrill. Niggas leaking their records when we speaking directly. If we keeping it gangster, when you see me, you check me. And that right there to me is just clown shit. Like, bro, we was boys at a point, so of course I'm gonna get on stage and this is my favorite rapper. Like, how you gonna throw this in my face? If we supposedly like cool and I get on stage, am I supposed to be like, hey, Rick Ross is a buster? Whoop de whoop whoop and whoop whoop. Nah, I don't like these niggas. Is it? That's why I don't, I don't, I, the homie, the homie logo, the friend logo, the associate logo, the co-worker logo, the relationships, I don't want it, bro. Let me just get my kids, my little bitch I'm messing with, you know what I'm saying? That's it. These niggas, these females, these, these dogs and cats, birds, bro, your car be dying on you. Everything scandalous. Everything scandalous, bro. I just want to, I be, I be, give me my piece, leave me alone. I got on stage and said, you my favorite rapper. Like, yeah, I know, because you my favorite rapper. I, I, damn. Anyway, nigga, that's why you had operation to make your nose smaller than your father knows, nigga. Oh, nigga. Wait, <laughs> You ain't never wanna be a nigga anyway, nigga. That's why you had operation to make your nose smaller than your father knows, nigga. This is my first time hearing Drake had an operation on his nose. And it all come with beef, that's what I'm saying, squad. The whole push of T. First time I'm hearing Drake had a kids from that nigga. I don't want no relationships with nobody. Let me, let me be. I don't follow you, nigga, cause you sent the motherfucking cease and desist to French Montana, nigga. See? You sent the police, nigga, hating on my dog project. That wasn't the same white boy that I seen. Hold on, squad. We thought you would follow Rick Ross. I mean, Drake, because he was messing with your itch. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, bro, everybody, everybody in the rap in industry is Eskimo brothers. What's that, Ghost? They all hit, be hitting the same female and just be, oh, bro, you hit that for real. Was it good? Well, let me see if 
We didn't know it was over French Montana. These, these disc records is crazy, bro. We be fine. <laughs> oh, this is equivalent to like, y'all know how, y'all seen it a million times, bro. When a female break up with you or you leave her, she want to say, that's why your thing little. This is what these rappers be doing, my nigga. As soon as they start beefing and they break up and don't want to be friends, that's why. That's why, that's why. That's why, that's why. I'm like, damn. <laughs> Keep talking, Ross. Let me know some more. You said the police nigga hating on my dog project. That one the same white boy that I seen, nigga, when we were making them early records, nigga. The when you were boy. happy to be around, nigga, seeing niggas holding them sticks. Yeah. You old motherfucking stun of your life, nigga. Get mm. Weezy some more money, nigga. Mm. Get Rap a lot some more money, nigga. Mm. White boy. Call him a worker. Yeah. Biggest. It's Rose, nigga. We can do it how you wanna do it, where you wanna do it, anytime you wanna do it. I'm ready. I'm ready, white boy. Huh? I know you got your Dockers on with no underwear, white boy. Yeah, you had that surgery, that six pack on, that's why you wearing that funny shit at your show. You can't hide it, nigga. White boy. So that six pack surgery was tr anyway, bro. That's Rick Ross, man. I'm gonna get at y'all next time. I'm about to tap out and upload this in the morning. I was gonna do it tonight, but I don't feel. <laughs> I'm about to chill, man. Catch y'all later, one hundred.